Hello folks, welcome to another Cash Guy video. Um, this is going to be a continuation in the Wish.com buying series. So uh, you can watch my first one in this series by clicking the link at the top of the screen now uh, where I got some of the interior uh, rubber mats which didn't actually end up being that great. So we're going to go on and we've got delivered just the other day these. They are for a Cash Guy. Um, so, as you might be able to tell, hopefully, these are what's known as sill protectors. They are metal, uh, quite a thin metal if I'm honest. In fact, you can see in the shipping from China they have bowed a little bit. Um, but they do look like I might be able to bend them back into the right shape. So we'll see when we go down to the car how they're looking. Um, this set um, I will post the link to. Uh, it cost me, uh, I think it was a total of £15, including delivery. Um, so it's not too bad. They are available in white, which is what these are. This is actually just a protective film that we'll be able to peel off and it should be either white or just um, like an embossed colour, if that makes sense. Uh, so whites are also available in red and blue. I was really tempted to go with the red um, because my Qashqai is uh, red. Should get a knife. Yes, so yeah, my Qashqai, as you may know from my other videos, is red, but it is the magnetic red colour, which is like a dark red. Um, the pictures made the um, the red text look very, very red. So maybe if you've got the cherry red Qashqai, which I'll put a picture up now, if you've got one like that, uh, it may be more suitable for that one. So we've got four pieces. Two small ones, obviously for the two rear doors, and two large ones for the two front doors. One and two. Now on the back of them we've got two strips of what is looks to be what you call 3M tape. Um, so hopefully that will be strong enough to hold it in place. We'll see. Um, and also, I'll take this one out. Around the edge, I do quite like, we've got this um, rubber strip um, which runs the whole around the whole edge, which should stop any dirt and um, you know water getting in. Because at the end of the day, this does sit on the exterior part of the door that hasn't got much of a seal on it. It does have a bit of a seal on it, but it's not going to stay absolutely uh, waterproof and uh, free from muck. So we are going to have to do a little bit of prep work before we fit these. Um, let's just peel off this blue that I was saying about. So it's sort of in there, if I can get my nail in. Oh, I can't quite get to that one. It's going, there. it's going to take a while because as you can see each each letter of Qashqai has got this film in it. There we go. So, I'm going to get my nails under it. So, this one is completely clear. Um, you could have had a like a red fill in here or the blue, like I said. I've just gone for straight clear uh, just because I think it looks nice. And, like I said, the red just looks a little bit too dark red, uh, a little bit too light red, even for what I'm after. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to peel off all of these little bits of blue before we get down to the car just to make it easier to. Um, do it whilst I can hold it and pull them off. Uh, then we're going to go down to the car, do a little bit of prep work because you know don't want this to go onto a mucky surface. We want to do a bit of cleaning first before it goes on, um, and then we'll get them fitted. So yeah, fast forward now, and hopefully I'll be down at the car. Okay, so uh, I've got all of the uh, bits off now. Just before we go down to the car, I just want to explain something. Um, these you can see it won't focus very well, but. Um, you can see it follows the shape of the door shuts. Uh, so it's going to be interesting when we get down to the car just to see how this goes. It's the same for the small ones and the larger ones. They have that same um, sort of step down. Um, I'm probably going to put like some weights on top of these because, as you can see, uh, they definitely have bowed whilst being shipped from China at the end of the day. So uh, it's done quite well to get over here, not too bad. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put some weights on top of them just for a little bit, just to try and straighten them out. Um, and finally, one thing I did want to mention to you is I'm going to put my referral code for Wish.com in the description. Um, if you do join Wish.com, um, this is not sponsored or anything like that. I just figured I'd do a series on Wish.com accessories. If you do join Wish.com um, with my referral code, you will get £4 off your first purchase. And also, I'll get £4 credit towards any purchases I make. So it helps me to make future videos on more Qashqai and other car products from Wish.com. And also it gets you £4 off your first order, so it's worth doing 
uh, if you don't mind um, using that referral code. Like I say, I'll put it in the description. So for now, I'm going to put, put some weights on top of these and then we'll get down to the car and do a bit of cleaning and get them fitted. So we're now down at the car and as you can see, um, the sills are pretty mucky. Rainwater, sand, grit, that sort of stuff. So we're going to give them a clean first. So to do that, I'm going to use, as you can see, just some simple um, antibacterial spray, just something like that, just to give it a clean. Got a microfiber cloth and a drying chamois leather stuff thing. So to give it a spray first, and you can see this step that we've got, this lip here, um, that we've got uh, cut into the sill protectors. Good. The main point here is trying to get any dirt, dust and especially water off of this area so that we can get a decent adhesion to it. So that, just dry it off. There we go. So <clears throat> without taking the sticky back off we can see it's going to sit something like that a better view of it. Um, obviously I want to try and make this as equal as possible so what I'm going to do you can see you get a little bit of the uh, lip each side I'm going to measure to make sure it's equal each side so then when I do the passenger side we get the same results. off of here. So again, good use for fingernails. There we go. And line it up with the bodywork itself. how we end up. So we'll do the back ones as well. Now these are the ones that I definitely need it for because my son getting out of the, in and out of the car he always gives it a good kick. So once again, a bit of spray. Wipe it down. Again you can see the lip that's in here. perfectly they're really well made these are actually to see they're so cheap you can see the lips it's perfectly on it so it can only sit in that bit um, I think we're gonna go with obviously we don't want it on the curved area because we'll end up with this gap underneath we want it to be as flat and true as possible so side because as you can see the lip if I take it out the lip ends there if we put it up to that point which is there we do end up with the gap underneath is true there so we're gonna have to push up a little bit more to there I think once the adhesion done hold it in place so yeah we'll go for there so remove the two 3m 
trips. Two. And push it against the actual body. There we go. So again you can see that lip there sits nicely in that groove. Push it down front and back. Quite a nice addition that, looks really smart. Door shuts finally. Really nice. So now I'll get the other side done and then I'll give you a tour around the car at the end. So there we go, they're done. I'm really happy with these actually. For the price I paid, they are really good. I'll give them a solid nine out of 10. Uh, the only reason I'm taking one point off, if I'm gonna go for a, a score of 10, is purely this black clip. So the lip that runs all the way along it, it is on that end, so there's a, a slight gap there. Um, because like I said, you don't want it up here because of the curvature of the car, you'd end up with a gap in the middle of it. Whereas because we put it on the flat bit, there's no gap. But uh, yeah, that was really smart as you can see, I think you'll agree. Um, maybe I should have gone for the red ones, just so that the Qashqai logo was more obvious as you opened it. But it's, uh, I'd say it's pretty, pretty smart looking to be honest. So there we go. Door shut fine over them, there's no catching or anything. There's all the remainder tape. And there you go, really happy with those guys. Yeah. So, as usual, folks. Oh, get back in the car. As usual, um, feel free to like and subscribe. Subscribe. Um, any questions, just ask away. Uh, do consider joining my uh, Cash Guy Club that's on Facebook now. Um, I try and help you out. And also, I've got members helping each other out, which is really great. Um, and do look out for that wish code uh, in the refer sorry, wish referral code in the description. Um, and uh, feel free to sign up using that code, and it'll get you four pound off your first purchase. And it will also get me four pound off future purchases myself. Um, the next wish.com purchase, I don't know what it will be. I'll see what I can find. Um, but until then, I'll see you in the next video.